<laughs> Alright, I might have found a way for you to see me solder. Let's see if this will work. We're gonna try it. Alright, we're gonna try it. Make sure you wear your safety glasses too. Always wear safety glasses because this stuff can pop and if it gets in your eye, your eyes are done. So, got my solder here. That's the kind of solder I like. Uh, I'll be honest with you, I don't think there's any difference with the solder. You just got to know lead free and all that other good stuff. Here we go. Here, but you don't want to burn that. You don't want to burn that. If you burn it, your solder will stick. So get it nice and hot about right there. You don't want to burn your flex. About right there. And use map gas. Map gas gets hot a lot quicker. See the bubbles? That can get in your eyes too. When the bubbles stop, see they're almost they're stopped. Here we go. It's starting to take. And what you want it to do, you want to put it in one spot and you want it to chase, let it chase itself around. That way you know you've got good bonding. Once you see it chase itself around like that, you know you got a good bonding. Then I like to come back. Come back. Just hit it again. Just like that. Just like that. Let's get the top. And see if the solder stays up there, that means you got it flux good. If it runs out like water, you don't have it flux good enough. Because that flux pulls it in. It pulls it in. Just like that. You'll see it start to pull itself in. It'll start puddling. It'll puddle. You want to make sure you got it all the way around. And what I like doing, what I like doing to kind of cool this real quick, I like hitting it with the flux again before you hit it with water. Because if you got a leak, if you didn't solder it all the way and you got a leak, then all you have to do is just heat this up again, most of the time. Heat it up again, and it'll solder it right back. You don't want to inhale this stuff either, man. I'm trying to just blow it away. Just let it burn off. And then you can take a rag or something. You can take a rag or something. And cool it down. I don't have to right now. I'm just letting it cool. See? See those little pinholes in there? See those little pinholes? See those little pinholes? I don't like that. I don't want to see that. So I'm going to hit it again. I'm gonna hit it again. That's why I don't hit it with water right away. Can leak. That's why I don't hit it with water right away. Because if you hit it with water right away, you don't want to breathe those in, those fumes in. Over time, they'll get you. You hit it with water to contaminate it. So that's how you solder YouTube. So I'm going to go ahead and work on getting the valve together, letting this cool down for a second. I'll get back to you.